Over the past 25 years, your support has helped to fund vital research so that today the outlook of a child diagnosed with cancer or leukaemia has improved enormously. I don't know about you, but me as a parent can't imagine what it's like to lose a child. The pain, the loss, the emptiness, the grief. But the O'Gorman family, Marion and Eddie, they lost two children. They lost their son, Paul, aged just 14, to leukaemia, and nine months later, their daughter, Jean, lost her fight to cancer. I personally think it says a lot about Marion and Eddie O'Gorman. They then turned what was a small memorial charity into one of the leading forces of paediatric oncology in the world. Now it's time for you to meet two mums. Two mums that will be eternally grateful for the help that they, their families and their desperately ill children can count on when they needed it most. You got wires going in. You got wires coming out of your skin. You got tears making tracks. I got tears. That are scared of the facts running down corridors through automatic doors. Got to get to you. Got to see this through. We were extremely lucky. We had wonderful support from friends, from family, from looking out of the bedroom window at Great Ormond Street and seeing children with Cancer UK across the road, knowing that there was always things going on in the background to try and make this easier for people. Now you know what it is, what do we do? And they said, well, it's got to have ag aggressive chemo and we've got to start it now. And I said, I don't care what you do or how you do it. Save my son. Help comes in from, from people and places that you never knew existed. I think the kindness of strangers hits you more than ever. That you see the value in, in people's words and actions. We had a remission party for Caelan's 11th birthday. He wore a sash and on the back it said, Caelan won, cancer nil. And now my feelings are, you tried, but you didn't get him. And I'll be grateful for that forever. When you have children, you you love them so much and you will do anything for them but sometimes you just can't do what they need at that time and that's where you can you have charities like Children with Cancer UK who do that part for you without them we wouldn't have Rose without them we would be a family lacking somebody very special Your support and generosity really has helped save many young lives so on behalf of Children with Cancer UK and the families that you've been able to help, we'd like to say thank you. So thank you. Thank you very, very much.